Uh, hello, I wanted to do a, a book review about a book that I just not read, but it's a drawing book. So it's called The Simpsons Handbook, um, Secret Tips from the Pros. And um, it's a library book that I've borrowed from um, the library, uh, like uh, I think it was like Mount Waverley Library or something like that in uh, Melbourne. But um, you can probably get it around somewhere. But um, it's just so good. I just have to do a video to talk about it. Um, the Simpsons is one of my favourite cartoons ever, like, um, it's so, such a big thing, like, for many people, actually, um, like, growing up in the 90s, like, it was awesome. Uh, I don't even have to talk about it, I don't think, because you already know how much people love The Simpsons, and I'm the same, I love The Simpsons, I love the characters, and, um, when I was look looking for, um, drawing books, uh, in the library, I, I spotted this one, and I was like, ooh, I want to learn how to draw The Simpsons, so I borrowed it, and, um, I slowly made my way through it, and, um, it was fun, like, it was, it's such a good book, like, at the start, I had no idea how to draw them, but it's set out in such a easy, accessible way, that it takes you step by step through how to draw, like, it starts off with Homer, and it just shows you, like, how to draw, like, the certain shapes, how to do his head, how to, then how to do his body, and then, like, different emotions that you can express with the, the, the face, and so on, so on, and, um, yeah, and then it shows you his hands, like a whole page of just his hands in different positions and things like that. And it has like um, just little tips on like like positioning, the little things that will make um, the drawing really become Homer. Because like, you know how you can do certain things and it just wouldn't be quite right because there's a certain way to do it to make it turn out the way um, Homer looks. Things like that. And then it just goes through the whole family. Like, um, And what happened was... Um, I borrowed, or I reborrowed this book a few times, and then um, I just realized that it's due in one week, and I reborrowed it twice, and I have to return it. So I thought, no, this weekend I'm just going to sit home and just try to finish this whole book. So I just did something that I rarely ever do, but I enjoy. But also, yeah, I really enjoyed it actually. I woke up in the morning to start drawing, and just like pretty much the whole, it was like cramming for an exam in a way. Like this weekend, I was just drawing a lot of Simpsons. And um, I, f I feel so much better having done it. Like, I feel like I've really learned how to draw, like, cartoon characters. Like, I just feel like I understand it a lot better now. Um, and this book is, like, the main reason. It's just so, uh, like I just said, um, so easy. Like, I'll just show you a few things. Just, it's fantastic. It has an intro by Matt Groening. Um, and then, like, oh, it's just so cool. Like, I'll just show you a few pictures. Like, so it starts off with things like this. Like, it's just got... Homer's face, and then like pad drawing, like just um circles, like how you start off, and it's funny like um all the Simpsons are very once you learn the basics of it, it they're just different shapes, like they'll have the you start off with the eye and then the head shape and then the lip and it's all basically the same thing but totally different because of all the different shapes and stuff like that. It's fascinating actually. Really, really fascinating. And then they have cool stuff like um, see this page. It's like a Homer there, but then it's like a you flip up, and then you got stuff underneath. It's just awesome. So it has all the family in, in lots of detail. So I went through all that stuff. Um, and like you know, you learn all things like Marge's hair, like how many kind of um, scallops they call them, like the little bumps to make her head, like and stuff like that. Um, I show you like a zillion drawings I just drew, like um. Like, I started off, these were my first homers. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that. But I did so many pages of it. Oh, like, um, there's a zillion of them. And at the start, it was just really hard because I just could not get it right. Like, it was just like, it did, like, the, my first few pages doing it, um, it just didn't feel right. Like, I mean, but, um, sometimes I would get it and it would look kind of like it. And, um, but just as I went along, it slowly kind of clicked more and more, especially with each character. Once I learnt Homer, then I learnt Marge. Those were the hardest, I think. And then I think Lisa and Bart, they were easier. Because it was funny how, like, there's actually relationships between the characters. Like, Homer and Bart. Bart is a lot like Homer, but just a, a thinner version. Like, he's not as fat. I mean, there's similarities and stuff. And, and like, Lisa and um, things like that. Lisa's got, like, a necklace like her mum, but has less beads and things like that. Little things like that. So I drew a zillion of them. Like, this is my Marge pictures. I mean, I just use lots. Like, I don't normally draw this much um, until I had to do it to return this book. So, I did a drawing of that. And Bart, here's me doing Bart. Like, look, look, I did Bart from like, different angles and stuff. 
<laughs> which is all in the book. Um, and like, I'm... Oh, here's a, me doing a zillion hands and feet. <laughs> so, I don't know, it's just really good. Um, when I got to Lisa, I started getting more confident with um, how everything was and things like that. Oh, I did a zillion Lisa's, so like, geez, wow. And I didn't even notice a lot of things, like, um, just, like, she has a certain amount of, um, pointy things on her head, things like that. Um, so basically, this book, if you, if you're interested in learning how to draw The Simpsons, I highly, highly, highly recommend doing it. Uh, if you're just interested in learning how to draw better, like cartoons or just things in general, I really recommend this book as well. It's just so fun and, um, and it's thorough and, and, um, some of the characters they'll have, like, because then after the family, it goes on to all the characters in the, the all the popular characters from the, uh, from the town, like Principal Skinner, um, Apu and things like that. And then, um, for some of them, they'll have, like, a, a an extra page where it'll be just, like, tips from the pros. So it'd be like someone who loves to draw them from the you know, team that draws The Simpsons. They'll talk about like, oh, whenever they draw um, Wiggum, um, the Officer Wiggum, Chief Wiggum, <laughs> I forgot his name, the cop. <laughs> they always think of donuts. So, oh, I'll show you. It's so funny. Um, <clears throat> so he's near the end, I remember. You learn how to draw Itchy and Scratchy and everything, the comic book guy. Um, Police Chief Wiggum. <laughs> Anyways, um, so like, look at this one. It's like you have the normal bit where you learn how to draw him, and then you flip it open, and there's an extra bit where it just shows him as a donut. So, <laughs> awesome. I mean, it's just a labor of love. Like, so cool. I just love it. Um, and then the amazing, the most amazing thing is right there. Okay, then they go through the Simpsons and their different outfits and stuff, like, just like, pajamas and vacation wear and things like that, um, butts and superhero costumes and stuff, and then they talk about the backgrounds, it's amazing, like they go through backgrounds, like you know, the, the kitchen and the things like that, just talking about the different perspectives and stuff, and it's like really um, interesting to learn uh, things like this, just how, how it's like really they use like one point perspective, two point perspective, all this kind of stuff and just the detail like this is the comic book store you know and they just talk about how you know it's so whoever drew, whoever created that probably really loves comic books and really knows what's inside a comic book store and stuff like that and the night, the really coolest thing is right, right at the end um, just, ah, oh, I won't show you <laughs> oh, maybe I will it's just really cool. This book is awesome. I'm just going to leave it at that. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. So I'm going to return it from the library, but I learned so much from it. And um, I just feel, yeah, I feel good that I can draw the, the Simpsons characters because I love these characters a lot. And, um, yeah, if you are if you love the Simpsons and you like drawing, um, I would recommend um, looking at that, finding that book. It's on Amazon. I just saw it then because I just did a review, typed a review on Amazon on it. Um, but, yeah. If, you live in Melbourne, um, it's at some libraries and stuff like that. So uh, that's all for the video, and yeah, that's it.